Hey everyone, welcome to my channel guys and hope you all are doing well and in this video I will be watching the making of Malai Kotte Valiban so it's like a three minute video just a little over three minutes and I know there is a one interview that I definitely want to watch that's with uh, you know that's on the Galata Plus channel uh, and it's it's almost one and a half hour so I'll, I'll definitely make a reaction for that but yes, I need, I need to take out time, like proper time for it. So anyway, uh, let's watch this video. I'm very, very excited to see like how the making looks because one of the biggest strengths of this film are the visuals and how the camera work was done. So yeah, let's watch this video right away. I love this theme music for MV. Da, 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 da. Oh, the entire action set piece over here. Okay, ready? Ready. When he smiles, everyone, everyone laughs. Can we turn on some set? Oh, there are no subtitles. Stone carving. Nice, nice. <laughs> like, like even these shots look so cinematic. I, I mean, this is a making video, but I'm just saying this also looks so freaking cinematic. <laughs> Which is this location, if anybody can tell me? Wow. Action. Yo. Ready. Oh. Look, did you see that? I mean, I'm sure a lot of people have watched that. Look at that. The cannon shot. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just a glimpse of it, but guys, there was a person who was... Rotating the cannon. Oh man. Okay, whoever this person is, salute to you. Like, oh, come on, guys. This, these are like little, little things. Everybody's effort, everybody's effort is like, even if it's the minutest of effort, it makes a big difference. Like, this is this cannon fight thing was like the highlight point of the action over here so the guy rotating it i don't know how many because see you have to do takes like several takes right so this would have been tiring like physically exhausting also like i don't know how heavy that thing is it won't be as heavy obviously because otherwise uh you know one person wouldn't have been enough but still it's exhausting oh 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 it's all real explosion. Okay. Damn the effort. Oh man. I wish there were subtitles here, huh? Like he is, LJP is like, okay, like you have to do this. Like he seems also so involved. Obviously you have to be involved as a director. You the director is like the captain of the ship. But, oh man. Just the effort. Oh, he's like, oh, you have to say it from inside. That's why I hope that's what it means like when he's saying you have to say the dialogue like that it has to come from the stomach right hey. oh. what what is that 
realism taken to the next level ha huh? the stones are, uh, obviously the stone like stuff is falling on the crew as well what the hell? oh my god this guy has my respect oh so yeah so for me if you watched my review the harness shots so that, that's why i don't know if it was like deliberately shown like oh no it will look like that yeah he it's it, he was he is tied with a harness because i mean it maybe it has to look a little bit comical that's why i said in my review i don't it looks a little bit off but i don't know if it was deliberate because i feel that it was deliberate and the second dialogue is like come on <laughs> okay seeing is believing yes i mean just for the visuals man just for the visuals no some would say that what he has written watch only in theaters one might say that okay this is like the makers are being so desperate that why you are writing watch it only in theaters but i feel a movie like this anything else is left no okay let me stop this let me stop this i just feel that for a film like this it's uh, it's it's necessary to watch it in the theater because otherwise it, the the experience of watching those visuals the experience of watching those visuals can only be appreciated and enjoyed truly in the theaters because that same uh, feeling or that same emotion will not get invoked when you watch this like in ott i'm i'm sure in terms of storytelling and theorizing and kind of making your own perspective about the film yeah that's possible that's possible to do but just from a visual standpoint oh my god this has to be watched in theaters and lgp like when he's visualizing his thoughts he knows how to kind of execute it on screen this i have seen not just for this movie for all his films that i have watched till date I mean, there is a certain sense of wild imagination which happens in his mind, and he is exactly able to kind of portray it on screen, like down to the T. I mean, that's how perfect it is. That's what I'm. That's what I mean to say. So I really love those shots in where he's moving the cannon and the stones are falling. Not really stones, uh, but you get what I mean. But. okay the, the effort the blasts and everything everything is just uh, this looks so stunning like the making also looks so stunning i am just looking at the effort and it just doesn't go for this particular film i feel it goes for every film uh, that we watch uh, i know that in in the end uh, the movies are made to entertain the audience and if it doesn't work it doesn't work it flops in the box office and it's unfortunate i'm i'm sure like no producer no filmmakers want that and i don't think as audience also like at, at least from my perspective who loves watching films and content whenever i go in and spend my own money i don't want the film to be bad i don't want any content that i watch in the theaters or on my laptop phone whatever i don't want it to be bad i i mean as cinephiles i want everything you know i want to enjoy the film i want to enjoy the content or the web series or the song that i'm watching so uh, it's unfortunate when it doesn't work but it is what it is it's uh, so i in the end if somebody says that okay this look this might look like a deliberate like a desperate attempt to say that oh watch it only in theaters but then why shouldn't they say it they have also poured their uh, you know blood sweat and tears into it and in the end obviously it's the audience's choice but uh, i love this making uh, just to see like how it's just to appreciate how much effort everything takes like every bit counts the crew the just the effort of the crew you know because we see the finished product but uh, i particularly like seeing makings like behind the scenes uh just because to you know just because i can appreciate the effort of the crew because that's like a monumental task to do a monumental monumental task so yeah 
that was the reaction to the making of malai kotte baliban and uh, let me know your thoughts generally uh, about this video and you know about the film and just your overall experience i know you a lot of you have talked about this film in uh, in my review itself but yeah even if you want to say something more you are welcome to so yeah with that i will end this video here and i will see you soon on my next one bye